what is going on everybody this is Essen back here with another video so today i got lenovo p500 idpl laptop i have this laptop for over five or six years and it's getting slow i have also got today the samsung v9 ssd 860 evo ssd drive that i got it from best buy on black friday so in today's video i'm gonna replace the hard drive on this computer with the ssd drive and we'll see is any performance gained or will this make my computer faster or no and we'll try to answer the real question is is this even worth spending money to buy one of these drives and replace it into your old laptop so let's find out and make sure to click that subscribe button and the bell icon actually not mine this is my sister she's been using it for school but complaining a lot about this laptop is getting slow the specs on this laptop is not that great either it got 6 gigabyte of ram i5 processor third generation the clock speed of 2.6 gigahertz so this specs is not that great but computer is getting slow and we might benefit this laptop with replacing with this ssd drive so now i will show you guys how long it's gonna take this laptop for boot up from the very beginning and to the end to the desktop screen or opening a chrome from the very start so i'm gonna press these two at the same time and we'll see how long would it take So now the laptop has come to the desktop screen but as, as you guys can see there is still the circuit revolving the computer is still thinking let's now just press this chrome and see how long would it take to open the chrome as you guys still see three minutes for this laptop to start from the very beginning even if i open word document on the left let's see how long would it take so i'll just put 10 second buffer on that this is finally open now it took around two minutes to open a word file so it's really slow it's it's, it's a lot of pain i'm gonna close this now i'm gonna take out the hard drive and put the ssd i'm gonna start opening this laptop from the back open this laptop now this is the hard drive that i will be replacing it just need to open these two so you have to be careful with these things push it back like that so this is the hard drive that i'll be replacing this one is the one terabyte drive so perfect i'm gonna take this out 
and now I'm gonna open this new SSD drive let's see what this one has to offer Is this one worth it or no perfect the packaging is not bad so here it got a user manual I don't care here's the actual hard drive perfect this one is much lighter than this old hard drive very lighter so I'm gonna use this one put this into the computer now so the hard drive is done I have installed it properly so I'm gonna put all the things back now so guys I have done installing the SSD drive onto this computer on the background I'm just gonna install the Windows 10 real quick so guys SSD is installed I have put back everything everything is all screwed up everything is fine so here I'm gonna do a boot test really fast and see the comparison of before and now I'm gonna press, press these two at the same time and let's see how long it's gonna take to boot up the computer so let's see I have uh, put the push button I have installed the windows everything is good I'm gonna put the pass real quick so literally you can guys can see it took me 13 to 14 seconds to boot up the computer everything is fine it's not there's no circle running around wow that's really cool. i'm gonna open the uh, word and see how long it's gonna take to open wow that's pretty impressive wow so before as i was using the hard drive the mechanical one and i checked it and it took me around two to three minutes just to open the word document but everything is done I and mean, I'm gonna op try opening the PDF let's see how long it takes wow it's really fast to be honest and how about the Chrome it's really fast wow there's a huge difference I would highly recommend you guys to put these SSD drive there's a big difference literally it took around 10 to 8 seconds to boot the computer up so what I'm seeing is there's a huge difference if you put the SSD drive it feels like a whole brand new computer. I can't stress enough to guys get one of these SSD drive. These are not that bad as cheap. I got this 500 gigabyte for $84, but I got the higher version of it, 500 gigabyte. But if you put 250 gigabyte, that comes around 45 bucks Canadian. So that's pretty cheap. Any old computer sitting in your house to a brand new computer and makes it much faster. So thank you guys. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys do, please give this video a huge thumbs up and see you guys in the next video.